So, uh, Vanakam Nashok Surya, Mindam Glanavarin Sadipadil Magachi. Today we have uh, Vikas, uh, very good, uh, interesting person to talk with, lot of uh, movies in different languages. Welcome, sir. Vanakam. Vanakam, sir. Rumba Nandri. Rumba Nandri, sir. Uh, first of all, uh, lot of languages, lot of acting, Nareya roles. So, how is it uh, working in different languages and specifically in English? Because there are different people there, different languages. <clears throat> and specifically the Gandhi murder as well. So how was the working experience in that movie? Oh, the first part of your question, you know, working in different languages is the reason, you know, uh, I like pick up any language very quickly because I learned Sanskrit during my childhood, uh, like Om Bhur Bhua Swata Sabdur Varinam Bhargo Devas Dimaydi Yo Yona Prachodaya. All these, you know, shlokas and mantras and all that. So the all the languages, you know, Tamil is uh, Sanskrit almost. So is so all Indian languages are inspired by Sanskrit. Even all the words language, you know, somewhere it touches Sanskrit. Sanskrit. So uh, uh, so that is easy for me because I learned it in during my childhood. Because I come from a theater background, so uh, you know it's easy to express your uh, emotions uh, through your characters and through. So it's not so difficult for me. And as far as the second part of the question, uh, the Gandhi murder is concerned, it's a very big Hollywood film because Avatar villain, Stephen Lang is there, the guy who was there in Avatar 1, 2 and Don't Breathe, Mr. Stephen Lang is playing main role in this film and I'm playing the villain, Nathuram Bhotse. You must have seen Kadaram Kondan and I played Vincent, that villain who wants to kill Chiang Vikram sir in the whole film. And I was, uh, you know, I gained weight a lot. I, I look almost 50, 55 years old in that film and I'm totally different right now. So I use to do all that experiment what an actor needs to do, you know. So the Gandhi murder movie is very challenging because it's very unique. It's not a regular film like you see in theater. I can, you know, say after 23 years of my journey of acting, I have never ever gone through such kind of script, which is so true. The whole world is, you know, uh, in love with Mahatma Gandhi. And everybody, everybody knows that Nathuram Gorsa killed Gandhi, Nathuram Gorsa killed Gandhi, that we learned from childhood. And uh, they put a kind of hate, you know, to bring oaths. So a certain kind of community can hate Nathuram Gorsa. Okay, that is okay. He was a killer and I'm not saying Nathuram Gorsa was a hero because I'm playing that role. But there was circumstances, situations, there are so many things, you know, which allowed Nathuram Gorsa to kill Mahatma, to kill Mahatma Gandhi. So the story is very unique. It's not a, a regular film. Uh, first time you will see the real incident like a documentary. I'm not saying a documentary. It's almost document facts, which we provided to Censor Board, more than 600 pages of evidence, you know. So we gone through, you know, very tough and difficult process of getting the approval because my director is uh, a very renowned uh, person and he refused that this film is not a fictional film and Censor Board was insisting to put that board, you know, it's a fictional film. No. So <clears throat> the Gandhi murder is unique because it shows what exactly happened you know, the two side of the coin, not only Nathuram Gorse, but the government, the Congress, police, and everybody was involved. How come? That I will tell you. 30th January 1948, Nathuram Gorse Mahatma, killed Mahatma Gandhi. But on 20th January, Madan Lal got arrested and he thrown a hand grenade and a bomb on prayer meeting of Mahatma Gandhi on 20th January and 21st January, he gave all the details to the cops 
in interrogation and he told Nathuram Godse and his friends Vishnu Kartare, Narayan Apte and these guys from Akhil Bharti Hindu Sabha, they are going to come and kill Mahatma Gandhi. You caught me, but you can't save Mahatma Gandhi. Okay. Then my question to the whole India is what that government was doing that time, you know, what Nehruji was doing that time. For example, if today I throw a bomb on the president of the country, what Modi ji will do? Modi ji will, you know, ask the DIG and IG, who is this guy who has got what he said, which gangs he belongs to? Hundred of questions, hundred percent. And he will increase the security of precedent for sure. But that didn't happen. Nobody was caught. Why? Why police couldn't caught that time? Nathuram Godse, Vishnu Karkare, Vina, uh, uh, Apte, uh, all those guys, why? Because there is other side. There was a clash between Nehruji and Gandhiji after the partition of India, as we signed an agreement with Pakistan that we will pay 75 crore rupees, but only 20 crore rupees was paid. And they started killing Hindus. And Nehruji was, you know, against this. And he said, I will not give 55 crore rupees because they are killing Hindus. I'm proud of Nehruji for that. But what happened, you know? Lord Mountbatten, governor of that time, said, no, you have to pay because that is the agreement. But Nehruji refused. Then Mountbatten came to Gandhiji to request, you know, you have to do this because this is legal papers, you know. Then Gandhiji requested Nehruji to give that money. Nehruji refused. Sorry, Gandhiji, I can't pay. That same Nehruji who uh, got elected with one vote of Mahatma Gandhi. For the prime minister of the country saying, Mahatma Gandhi, I will not pay. It, it doesn't mean Mahatma Gandhi wanted to pay that 55 crore rupees to Pakistan to kill Hindus. No. Mahatma Gandhi insisted because we got freedom and that agreement was, you know, between British and us. So they can interfere and they can disturb our peace. So Mahatma Gandhi went on fast against Congress. First time ever in his life. And he, his fast and his demand was, you, you have to pay 55 crore rupees. Immediately, Nehruji said, I will give 55 crore rupees. Means what? Same Nehruji, whom i proud of, what to say? I don't have words. I'm ready to give 55 crore rupees. It doesn't matter if you can kill Hindus. That's not a problem. It means, what, what it means, you know? So Nehruji was agreed to pay that money, but Gandhiji was a genius. He said, I'm not stopping here. You have to pay, you have to make sure that every Indian should come together. You know, all Hindu and Muslim should come together. Then I will break this fast and that shake in Congress. So here police department already arrested Madanlal. And here this clash is happening. And here Godse, who was very angry because 55 crore rupees, if they will give to Pakistan, my brothers will be killed. So that's how this film deals with. And that's how, you know, this film is all about. So it is going to create a lot of controversy. I don't care. But I need to see that truth. And as an Indian, as an artist, I should show that truth, you know, because our art is the mirror of the society. We, we should remember our history, so it should not be repeated. So I don't want to make any political comment on this. Let the people decide of the country, you know, let, let the people see this film. And good thing is Mr. Nasser sir is there in the film. And uh, Nasser sir is my godfather because Nasser sir gave me a chance to act in Kadar. Kondan. He introduced me with Kamal Hassan Production House and he introduced me with Mr. Rajesh and Selva sir. And I, I love Rajesh and Selva sir. He is wonderful. He is amazing. So 
I followed everything, whatever he said during Kadaram Kondan. Okay. I worked with Ajit Kumar, said nobody knows in Arambha. I hanged okay. him, uh, you know, for 24 hours. And uh, uh, after 24 hours, I was tired. I said, Ajit, sir, I'm tired. Can you say to the director, pack up? Because, you know, you have a wild energy. I told that. He said, I can't say that because... Because how many people can become Vikas Srivastava or Ajit Kumar? I can work for 68 hours. That doesn't matter. And that was a lesson. From that time to till now, I never ever complained for anything, whatever is happening on the set. And I, I love uh, Chian Vikram, sir, because I was playing a goon in uh, Ravana. I was there in Tamil and Hindi, both version, and I was just standing with the stick, you know, no dialogues, no role. <laughs> but he treated me that time like a brother. He gave me hugs and he inspired me that you can be somebody someday. And uh, I love Mani Ratnam, sir. And uh, it was it was always a dream. It is a dream and it will be a dream to work again with Mani, sir. And Mani, sir, is a Great director. He's a Spielberg of India. I have never, ever seen such a genius, you know. Yeah. He he has every detail, everything. We used to shoot our film 4 o'clock in the morning, you know, Ravana. Uh, and 5 o'clock, they roll on the set. 6 o'clock with the sunrise, he catches all the nature and the color and the beauty. I love Manisa the way he loves India and the cinema. So Wait. this is it. Please watch Gandhi Murder on Z5. It released on the 2nd February. And please watch, please, because uh, we got adult rating. I'm really sorry to say that uh, there are a lot of films which have a lot of slang languages and abuses, but they give you a, but they have given a certificate, but watch that film, you know, so you will understand what I'm saying. Okay. Thank so you. Yeah, so Any actually, yes, um, so been so many informations right from uh, Mr. Ajit to <clears throat> Mani Ratnam to everyone. So this vast experience in uh, South as well, that's interesting to hear. And the uh, conversations with you, which you had with Ajit sir, everything, uh, you know, shared very brilliantly. So how was it, uh, you know, working uh, in Tamil movies since you said you can cope up with the language and you have given your own voice for Shadaram Kundan as well. So. How was it, uh, what were the inputs or the help that was given by our uh, uh, either uh, Chi and Vikram or um, Ajit sir or, or for that matter, what was the inputs that they're giving you for you? See, from Tamil cinema, I learned passion. I learned honesty. I learned discipline. So these are the things which Shyam Vikram sir and Ajit sir uh, told me and showed me through his work on the set that it it's not like that that we are very star person we are very important guys because God gave us this luck no they work really hard and they care about people and it does I'm sorry to say I'm sorry to say I've done so many Holly, uh, Bollywood films I can't. You can uh, Google, but that kind of discipline Bollywood don't have. I'm sorry. That kind of love and respect stars don't give to other co-actors. All 23 years, I felt that gap, you know, with the star and the actor. But while working with Ajit sir, while working with Vikram sir, I never felt they gave me a confidence, you know, they give that they, they give that kind of confidence to co-actor that you can perform well and you can be a star one day, you can be Rajni Khan sir one day, you know, don't think it's small. So thank you Tamil cinema, uh, you know, for that. And uh, I love Tamil cinema. Great. So uh, you love Tamil cinemas, right? I, I am sure that you'll be following uh, Tamil cinemas as well. You'll be watching a lot of movies here down south. So what yeah. is the recent movie that you watched in Tamil? I couldn't watch because I was shooting so many, but there are so many uh, uh, like Pita Magan, so many, so many films I can name, I can, but which is my favorite films, you know. <coughs> and uh, recently, uh, I got uh, uh, an offer. I'm supposed to work with Yogi Babu sir, and looking forward for that film. It's a sports film, and Lakshmi Movie Makers was supposed to. 
uh, produced that film uh, in January, February. I was supposed to shoot that film, but during uh, because of Corona, they pushed it, and uh, may, uh, now some new producer is producing, and there is a director called uh, Mr. Prakash. He is directing. You must have seen the poster which I sent you. So that is going to be another Tamil work, you know. And Mr. Riyaz K. Hamathar is uh, like my brother, and he's helping me a lot to get some more film. But because after Kadaram Kondan, uh, Corona came and Corona virus, yeah. you know, killed everyone, uh, killed cinema actually. Then OTT came and OTT hired everything. OTT actually killed cinema. So it's still, but that South cinema is there. Now <laughs> Bollywood is like, I did Dobara with Anurag Kashyap, my last film, just one month back, I think it's released, did nothing. So uh, uh, it's a very hard time for cinema. So let's see, let's let's pro pray for the best that people go and watch and celebrate cinema like we do, like like Tamil people do, you know. Like they see, they see Raji sir and Dhanush sir and Ajit sir and they, they throw coins, they dance in theaters. Uh, that that doesn't happen. Uh, that don't happen here, you know. Uh, yeah. Now and that that is the that that is lacking. That is uh, somewhere. I don't feel good about that. Okay. And can we uh, know a little more about your role in uh, the, your movie with uh, Yogi Babu? So, uh, what kind of role? Is no, I can't play? discuss, brother. You are killing me. You, they will. They, they will. Lakshmi movie makers will kill me. Okay. If they have left the film. My director will, you know, kick. So please, I can't tell anything about the film, but I will tell you this is this film never uh, been made in uh, Tamil. No, it's okay. a very unique film, and you will not see Yogi Babu as you have seen so many times. Okay. No. Okay. So you're going to be the villain for, for this movie? Can we? Yeah, can we... yeah. I'm playing the main villain, and okay. uh, uh, hey. <laughs> you are again, you're not taking out the things. No, you can't. Okay. okay. Great. So, uh, what are the, um, you know, uh, things that you're looking forward uh, post uh, this movie? After this movie, what are you looking forward to? Any any more upcoming movies or how you think this this movie? I want to, I want to travel. I want to travel the world. I want to go wherever films are happening. I want to act in Malayalam. I want to, Malayalam cinema is wonderful and uh, very meaningful. I worked with Priya Darshan in uh, Shah Rukh Khan's Billu Barber. If you remember, there was a right hand yes. guy with Ompuri like this. I yes. was that guy. I did so many films where you have to Google and you have to see that very, very small, 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 small part. So I'm that ant who is climbing some mountain, you know. So I want to do international cinema. And before I die, I want to work with people uh, like, like I want to work with the Spielberg once uh, before I die. Great, great. So we wish. Uh, and Mari, sir, yes. Okay. Again. Great, great. Sir. So, so, as you said, we wish uh, it happens to you. Uh, many more movies in Tamil and I hope the movie with Yogi Babu is also going to give you a lot of uh, credits and popularity and name and fame, everything that you wish for. I hope you do many more uh, movies in Tamil as well and looking forward to yeah, your please other movies. Tamil, please Tamil cinema, please Chennai, love me, give me chance. I'm your brother, I'm yours, I'm all yours. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much for all the time that you spent since half We had a lot of technical difficulties as well. And then somehow we finally that's connected. Okay, that's it. okay. That's part. You know, yes. That's part, Ashokji. Thank you so much, Ashokana. I love you. And thank you. thank you so much. All the very best for this channel. Please watch this film, not only for the star of Avatar and uh, James Cameron actor Stephen Lang. Don't watch for Vikas Shivasta. Watch for Nasser, sir, especially. Yes. Sure. That's so nice of you and so sweet of you. Thank you so much for your time. I hope we get to meet more and more. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Ashoki. Thank you. Love you. Thanks a lot. All the way. Thank you. Thank you.